Angular has announced their intention of adding signals as a reactive primitive in Angular. With the new reactive approach, the components will be able to track which part of the application's data they depend on and the UI can be synchronized only when that particular data changes. Thus, Angular will be finally able to move away from the zone.js based chain detection which currently triggers a top-down chain detection for the entire application. Sample Angular Signals implementation where this is the getter for accessing a value from a signal. This way you can create a signal to which multiple consumers can subscribe to receive update. And for setting new values you can use the set method. For updating the value you can use update and pass the updater. In case you want to compute certain values based on the signal, you can use the computed function. And finally, for executing side effects, you can make use of the effect function.